A certification can help you get a job in data science. But the most important thing is picking the right one, or it can just be a waste of time. So which ones are the best? That's hard to say, and it depends on your goals. But one certification that's gotten a lot of positive attention recently has been DataCamp. They offer many career certifications for people looking to become data analysts, data scientists, and data engineers, and more. And they even offer some certifications specifically for SQL, Tableau, and other skills. They're also providing this together with Microsoft and other top companies, which makes it even better. I've used DataCamp before, and I talked about it on the channel, and your feedback has been amazing. So I reached out to them, and I'm now making a sponsored series going through the ins and outs of their platform to help you find the right cert. But I'm going to do my best and show you the pros and cons, because while it is a great platform, nothing is perfect for everyone. In this video, we'll cover everything about their data certifications in detail, and they have a lot of learning material that you can go through, and when you're ready, you can take the exams and receive a cert. But we'll get into exactly how that works later. The main reason to get a certification is not for a nice piece of paper, but rather it's to make you look credible. You can have all the right skills in the world, but if you don't have a way to show that to an employer, you're simply not going to get hired. Now, I'm by no means saying that a certification is the only way of doing so, but it is one way and it's a good way, especially as a beginner, if you do it properly. Now, let's focus on the DataCam certifications. According to themselves, their goal is to be able to differentiate yourself and get an industry-recognized credential. Then, they also claim that they've upskilled 13 million people globally. And that's important because you don't want to get a certification that nobody's heard about. That's not going to be very helpful. I also like that they partner with some companies like Microsoft to provide these certs because that actually increases the perceived value and the industry recognition significantly. Now, they have three categories of certifications. And the first one is technology certs, where you focus on a specific technology, like SQL or Python. The next ones are the career certs, and here you'll focus on a particular role, like the data analyst or data scientist. It includes different skills for these jobs in one certification to really make you prepare for that specific role. And then we also have the fundamental certifications, which is kind of like a more basic cert where you put together data science stuff into one. So how does a certification actually work on DataCamp? You begin by registering, and then you're gonna have 30 days to complete the necessary examinations, kind of like a timed exam and a practical exam usually. They do also offer a readiness quiz before you actually get certified, so it's kind of a good option to take this one to see if you even should begin this process in the first place, or if you're very far away from it. You will usually be graded by an automatic system, meaning that once you complete your exam, you should have the results pretty much immediately. And after you're done, you'll receive a certification match from DataCamp, which you can print out or put on your wall or just do whatever you want with it. You can put it on your LinkedIn profile, put it on your resume, and it kind of looks like this. And once you're certified, you're also gonna get access to the private community. Now, I don't know how good this is. I have not tried it out, but they do claim to offer different events with different industry experts and kind of like a forum and you know helpful career resources. But again, I've not tried it out, so you would have to see for yourself. Now we're gonna dig into each of these certs that they actually offer on the platform. And these are of course gonna be updated all the time, but these are gonna be the main key ones that are active right now and the most important ones that most people tend to get. And these include the data analyst, the data scientist, the engineer certs, and there's also one for SQL, there's one for Power BI, one for Tableau, and one for Microsoft Azure. I'm gonna tell you everything you need to know about these so that you can find the best one for you. So first up on the list is the Data Analyst Cert. It's gonna show your ability to do common data analyst tasks like going through the data analytics lifecycle, communicating your results, and using relevant tools to do so. For example, SQL or Power BI. The language is English and you'll work in SQL and R or Python. It's up to you, so you can choose between R or Python, depending on which one you prefer, and you don't need to learn both of them. The cert is available at two different levels, and it's the associate and the professional level. The associate level focuses on validating the foundational skills, and meanwhile, the professional level certs cover some more complex skills and, in general, more advanced tasks with the skills and tools that you've already learned. So simply put, I would say that associate certs are great for beginners who are just stepping towards, you know, entering the data world, and professional level is better for those with some experience looking to more validate their skills and prepare for jobs. Next, we have the data scientist. And this one focuses on your ability to collect, analyze, and interpret large amounts of data using machine learning and AI when needed, and also communicating between stakeholders. 
Similarly to the previous certs, it's available in English and you can choose between R or Python depending on what you prefer. And it always includes SQL and is available at the associate or entry level. And then we have the data engineer and you allow to collect and pre-process large amounts of data to convert it into a suitable format for future steps and organizations to use. The next certification is the SQL Associate Certification. And unlike the career track certifications, which kind of provide a track specifically for one career, this one is going to be focusing more on a specific tool, which is Structured Query Language, or SQL. SQL is the backbone of relational databases and is essential for anyone who wants to extract, manipulate, and analyze data stored in these types of systems. And having SQL skills is invaluable for many data roles like the data analyst, data scientist, and data engineers. The next ones are slightly different, and we have the Power BI, the Tableau, and the Azure certifications, but these ones are actually not available on DataCamp. And rather, DataCamp offers a variety of resources and a learning path to help you prepare for these certs, which are then offered by other companies like Microsoft. For the Tableau one, it's offered by Tableau, and the Azure and Power BI certs are offered by Microsoft. And supplementing your learning with these specific certs is a great idea because these skills are what employers are really looking for, and they're also quite powerful certs by top companies, which I highly recommend that you actually take, or at least look into, especially if you're interested in a certification, it might be good to go to one of these companies since they are very well known and their tools are widely used in the space. If you take certain career paths at DataCamp, you can also get a discount on some of these ones. And an example is going to be the Power BI PL300 Data Analyst Exam. And if you do take certain career paths, including the standard Data Analyst Exam or the career path, you're going to get 50% off the PL300 exam, which will also help you prepare for that one as part of the DataCamp program. So it's a huge plus because you're both getting the standard DataCamp certifications and the top industry recognition, such as Microsoft. So now, how do you actually prepare for these ones effectively? And it really depends on the one that you're taking, but the underlying principle is that it's up to you. If you already have the skills, take the readiness test and see if you feel confident and then you could just go for the cert right away. But of course, if you're learning, you want some kind of path to go down. And that is why they offer different career tracks and skill tracks, and some of these will directly prepare you for certifications. They also recommend specific learning material if you do go to the cert page, because they have an extensive library of learning resources that you can access for free if you're a member. And you can prepare with these resources until you feel ready for the exam. That brings us on to the pros and cons. And one of the main benefits is that everything is included in the same subscription. And whether you're looking to just learn something, or you want to get certified or follow a specific learning path, everything's included. And if we do compare it to other options, DataCamp is actually quite affordable. They do also offer some discounts, some student things, and some promotions, where you can sign up for a year and kind of get access to everything they have for different sales. So just make sure to check that out. There are, of course, always different ways to show that you're a credible candidate, and a cert from DataCamp is one such way, but it's not the only way. But if you are going to go down this path, it's even more powerful when you do combine it with projects and building a portfolio, which you can also get help doing at DataCamp. They have a ton of other resources as well, including some projects that you can do, and everything's kind of included in the same subscription, so you can really just pick and choose between what you'd like without additional costs, which I think is a huge plus. And if you do feel like DataCamp is something for you, I'm going to leave a link in the description where you can learn more, including any ongoing discounts that I can find. And thanks for watching, and good luck on your learning journey.